Hey guys, welcome to Talk To Me Tuesday. It's Tuesday, February 4th, 2014. This is Jennifer. Um, this is going to be a short one today because this is the first time I've been out of bed in about two days. Um, you can probably tell that I'm pretty sick. I've been running a pretty amazing fever. I went and saw my doctor yesterday and she told me to stay in bed. So as soon as I'm done with this, that's exactly where I will be going. I do want to share a couple of small things with you. Uh, the As You Wish pattern for last week posted, and I'm going to show you guys mine. It was Wesley from The Princess Bride. So we have the man in black with As You Wish. This guy was designed by Lilia, and this was designed by Woozle Mom. So um, again, I'm doing the four patch version, as you can tell by my block, and uh, there are two versions of the quilt. Um, the next post for that will be next week, so it's every other Wednesday. Paper Piecing Vintage for February did update on Saturday, so make sure you got your pattern so you can make your Come Fly Away block. There'll be another pattern update on March 1st, and also make sure that you're in the Facebook group because there is some uh, content for Facebook users that I will not be posting anywhere else. Before I got sick, when I was still feeling fine, I went to a uh, sewing day with a bunch of friends of mine and I did get my binding stitch to the front of my um, Project of Doom signature quilt. I did a scrappy binding and I will show you guys better what this looks like after um, I get it stitched down. I did uh, house colors and um, I used fat quarters so I did uh, Basically the pieces are 20 to 22 inches long, so it will be uh, blue, green, red, yellow all the way around. So anyway, I will show you guys this a little bit nicer when um, I get it actually hand stitched. Another thing I want to share with you guys is on Friday I posted my stitched workshop from 2012. Um, if you guys have been around for a while, you know that in 2012 I was an instructor for an online uh, subscription-based workshop group called Stitched. And uh, at the time I was the paper piecing instructor for that and there was a workshop that you could follow and um, you there was like a whole cl online classroom environment. It was very fun. It was a whole year that I did this. And I've had this uh, workshop sitting for a year, not doing anything with it. So I decided this year I would post the workshop and instead of having to pay for the workshop, the only thing that you have to pay for is the pattern. The pattern is $4. The workshop is 39 minutes. So you get every tip and trick that I can possibly think of to do with paper piecing. I teach you everything from how to paper piece to how to paper piece all those weird little angles. So if you love the patterns on fandom and stitches or you love say my sunbonnet suit patterns but you don't know how to tackle all those weird little angles, this workshop teaches you how to do it. It's free on YouTube. I've got it on So Hooked. It's it's you can watch the whole video for free. You don't have to buy the pattern, but if you like what I do and you enjoy my work, I would appreciate you buying a pattern now and then because it, your purchasing patterns makes it um, possible for me to continue to offer free content. Speaking of free, the very last thing I'm going to do today is give away this awesome little pin cushion slash thread catcher. Um, this was donated by HP5 Freak, our lovely friend Amber, and this guy is a pin cushion and then you drop your little threads in here. This is weighted so you can sit it on your table with this hanging off. Um, also this is removable. It's got velcro on it and one person who posted a video in January is going to win this guy. So I already have all the names in here. I counted up. We had over 30 videos in January which we haven't had that many videos in a very long time. So I want to thank you guys from the bottom of my heart for getting back out there and really participating in Talk To Me Tuesday again. I've enjoyed seeing old faces, I've enjoyed seeing new faces, and I've really enjoyed seeing the creativity and all of the things that you guys have come up with. Um, I did not put myself or Amber in here because obviously she gave me one of these awesome little goodies for myself and she probably doesn't want her prize back. So this is everyone else. There are 26 entries in this bag and I am just going to pull one out and whoever's name is on the piece of paper, you're the winner. Um, I will have another prize for February, but I'm not going to show it today because I feel terrible and I want to go to bed as soon as I get this online. Alright, let's see who won this puppy. Alright, our winner is Jenny Floor. Welcome back, Jen. 
Uh, I'm so glad that you came back to do videos and I already have your address so as soon as I am not contagious and have cooties and whatever I'm gonna get this in the mail to you. Congratulations to Jennifer and thank you to everyone else that uh, posted videos in January. Again it was a totally awesome month and I actually sat and watched lots of videos last night in bed while I was uh, just resting in the four hours I was awake in that 24-hour period. I really have got to go back to bed. I'll see you guys next week. Bye.